official inauguration now in the books. Governor Katie Hobbs taking to the stage today to take the oath of office in front of other lawmakers, family and friends. In her inaugural address, Hobbs repeatedly promised to work with Republicans for the common good of Arizonans. But as ABC 15's Mark Phillips reports, the governor also made it clear she will have little time with lawmakers who insist on reliving election conspiracies. Under cloudy skies and a chilly breeze, Governor Katie Hobbs used her inaugural address to extend her promise of goodwill and willingness to work with all elected officials. You, the people of Arizona, gave me a clear directive. Find common ground, work with people and not political parties, and embrace the challenges that stand before us. Unlike her predecessor, Doug Ducey, Governor Hobbs inherits a strong economy, but it doesn't take much to see the challenges which lie ahead. The lack of affordable housing, water security, funding for public education, defending reproductive freedom and women's health rights, and maintaining confidence in our elections are just some of the issues Hobbs and the legislature will tackle this year. Let me say unequivocally to every elected official here today that if you're ready to make real progress on the issues that matter most, to the, to the people of this state, then my door will always be open. But the governor will have no time for lawmakers looking to rewrite history. The chasing conspiracy theories, pushing agendas for special interests, attacking the rights of your fellow Arizonans, or seeking to further undermine our democracy will lead nowhere. Governor Hobbs is the first Arizona governor since Janet Napolitano to lead a divided government. Longtime Republican political consultant Wes Gullett believes Republicans in the legislature will need to learn to compromise. If we want to keep the majorities, we're going to have to learn to work on the common good for Arizona. And if we can't do that, elections will happen. Inauguration Day is a time for hopes, dreams, new beginnings. The real work begins on Monday when the legislature reconvenes. Mark Phillips, ABC 15. Arizona.